Hey guys, my name is Ben. Welcome to Anderson University. I'm here to show you everything that makes AU special, from the academics to the traditions to the facilities and everything in between. Your journey begins right now. Let's go. <laughs> We're standing inside the Welcome Center. As a Raven, this is where it all begins. Here, you'll meet your admissions counselor, and it's also where you will sit down with your financial aid counselor. Everyone here wants to ensure you have what you need to excel as a Raven, such as game-changing scholarships, answers to questions about student life, and even making sure you have some AU gear for your first day. You can get a head start at previewing the scholarships available to you by visiting us online. Then, when you come for your in-person visit, you can meet your admissions counselor right here. One of the best things about Anderson University is chapel. There are numerous opportunities for chapel each and every week. We invite students to attend at least 18 throughout the semester. Some students attend all of them, some only go to 18, and others attend somewhere in between. We encourage students to get connected in ways that fit them best. And that's the awesome thing about chapel. There's something for everyone. You will hear from campus personalities, world-renowned speakers, and local leaders making a difference in central Indiana. And when we worship together, it could be you and your friends leading with the band on stage. Every college university needs that campus beauty spot. Perfect for Instagram and that one spot you think of whenever you picture the school. For AU, it's the Valley. If you ask us, there's not a better campus beauty spot in the country, no matter the season. The Valley is a beautiful gathering spot for campus. You will see students hammocking when it's warm or sledding down the hill when it's snowy. This is truly the hub of Anderson University's campus. You will walk through the Valley to get to almost all of your classes. Edwards Hall houses our theology and Christian ministry majors and is home to Miller Chapel. Connected right next door is Nicholson Library. On the south side of campus is Decker Hall, our administrative building. But that's not all it is. Many different academic departments are housed there along with several campus services. It's also where you will find our state-of-the-art esports arena. Our eSports team is growing fast and continues to add new games to its program. Next to Decker is Hartung Hall, home to academic departments like nursing and engineering. When you come to AU, you will have the opportunity to learn in some of the best facilities with equipment and tools that you need to be successful. For example, our nursing simulation lab and electrical engineering lab offer students a chance to work with top class equipment that gets them ready for life after graduation. Also, inside Hartung is our largest lecture hall that only seats 100 students. Why does that matter to you? Because AU is known for our small class sizes. You'll be getting personalized attention from educated faculty that genuinely want to build a relationship with you. Finally, Granite Hall is where our music, theater, and dance students, as well as our visual communication students learn. It also houses another engineering lab. And the best part about it all, these buildings are just within steps of each other, meaning you'll be learning in close proximity with the rest of your campus community. At AU, academics and student life are important, but you still need to make time to eat. Luckily for students, we have several on-campus options. I'm standing inside the old student center, and this is the marketplace, or MP for short and this is the main on-campus dining option. The MP is open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and serves the food buffet style. Ask any AU alum and they'll tell you that the chocolate chip cookies are to die for. Downstairs, you'll find Chick-fil-A and a very own coffee shop, Mocha Joe's. Mocha's and The Alley are favorite spots for students looking to study, grab a cup of coffee, or just rest between classes. Food isn't the only thing in the student center though. You'll also find our bookstore where you can get textbooks for classes along with Raven gear. 
I'm standing here in Dunn Hall's lobby. Dunn Hall is one of two male residence halls here on campus, along with Smith Hall. There are two female residence halls as well, Martin and Morrison. And each room in all four halls come with two adjustable beds, two dressers, two desks with chairs, and two MWARs. Welcome to the Karnatsky Wellness Center. I can't wait for you to walk through it yourself. The $17.4 million, 132,000 square foot Kardatsky Wellness Center provides programming for health, recreation, and wellness in all forms. The center brings together the departments of athletics and kinesiology. In addition, the center houses the athletic departments for AU's numerous varsity sports teams for men and women. For a Division III school, it'll be hard to find a better wellness facility than this. It has four regulation basketball courts, a full 200 meter indoor running track, and an auditorium. It holds a sports and medicine center, a full weight room, a human performance center, and a prayer alcove. There are tons of scheduled activities in the field house, but the university is committed to keeping one court and one track open for any student, staff, or faculty member that might wanna play a game of basketball with their friends, or use the track to go on a walk. As far as our varsity athletics go, AU offers everything from football to esports and competes in Division III of the NCAA. You will have the chance to play in excellent facilities and you will receive care in the state-of-the-art Gaither Sports Medicine Center. Even if you don't wanna suit up with the Ravens, you can still be involved. The Conspiracy, which is the proper term for a group of Ravens, is our official student section. They'll be at sporting events all throughout the year cheering our teams on. And you can be involved in intramurals if you'd like. Anderson University has a great intramural program with sports such as can jam, volleyball, indoor soccer, and so many more. Before we finish up, we can't end without showing you Helios. Built in 1993 by former professor Arlen Bayless, this is one of the most well-known parts of our campus. You'll see it on t-shirts, artwork, and all over Instagram. Make sure to stop and see it when you're on campus. Thank you for joining me on this virtual tour of Anderson University. So what comes next? We believe there is an Anderson version of you that is waiting to be discovered. It all starts with an on-campus visit. Your visit could be the start of an incredible journey. So reach out to the Office of Admissions for more information. Schedule your visit today. And remember, soar, Raven, soar. <laughs>